Well, last night we went and got this. And I got me a new car. Yes. I got a Chevy Traverse. It's a LT, I believe. Very nice car. We got this because there's no room in the truck for all three of us to go anywhere. And my mother has a hard time getting in and out of the truck. So we um, went and got this. And it's a 2010. Yep. Uh, got nice. Lots of room. Very nice. I'll open up the back since I'm already back here, I think. Nope. I got it locked, I think. Hold on. There you go. Unlock it. Oh, shoot. Let me see here. Hold on. I gotta get used to this. There we go. Okay, I got the door unlocked. Okay, so very nice. Got lots of bells and whistles in here. Quite nice. I've already taken pictures and I sent them to my aunt and uncle so they could see what I got on leather seats. Very, very nice. Yeah, so it seats seven people. The seats in the back go up. I'll show you in just a minute. It has a seat in the, has this thing in the middle here. It goes down. All of these seats will go down and flatten. So then you have one big, huge back. So I can haul a lot of stuff. We could also sleep in the back of it and do a camping night. Got mirrors up here. Nice little mirrors, see? Very nice. It's nice to drive, very smooth to drive. I got cruise control. I do not have a backup camera, but we ordered one and a new radio. So um, it was just best to buy the whole thing. And so we're going to get that, and uh, Shaver is going to do a review on that. So hopefully it, it wasn't too bad. I think it was like, I think he said 73 or $83 for all of it. Um, that's some wires and everything, and the backup camera comes with it. So not too bad. Okay. Not too bad. So I'll show you a little bit more. Maybe if I can unlock the doors. There we go. Alright, the door is unlocked. Yeah, so right here. And then we got one in the middle here. Nice. And it's got a cup holder. You can put things in there too. It's got a place right here. These are controllers for the air conditioning and heat. And also down here you can put your cell phone. Little cubby hole here. That's quite nice. I wish I had this when I had my kids were small. We would have had a ball in this. And I got little pockets here. And on the, each side of the door, you get a cup holder here. And there's a cup holder down here too. So you can have two. There's plenty of cup holders. Very, very nice. So I'm quite happy. And what you do, you push this in. You just push it in and out. And the other day, if you've seen Shaver's um, video, you would have noticed we were trying to find the, the key, the lock for it, because I thought maybe there was a pulley in the uh, by the seat, but there wasn't. So he went up to it and pushed it, and that was it. So that was cool. And this is the very back. And as you can see, these are seats right here. They come up, and, oh, and then you push them up. And I'll push this one up here. And, oh, hold on. i got to grab it. And there you go. So, oh, very nice. And to put it back down, you just hit this. And it comes right back down. Yeah, just like so. And you can do one side or the other side, too. So you can have it both ways. Quite nice. And over here, yeah, you can pull this down and push it down. Um, ooh, see how it, ooh, isn't that neat? Oh, it goes like that too. And then you can push it back. Oh, that's neat. Ooh, I didn't know it did that. That's kind of neat. Yeah. And then it flattens too. This right here is the only place that is missing this borderline here. 
so on this one and that was it so it goes down like that so you could do both very nice oh, I like this interior is really good no rips or tears was a hundred nine thousand miles on it for 2010 I believe that uh, I'm probably an older person probably had this um, or a someone who didn't drive a whole lot had a uh, you know uh, in the garage a lot that's what I think so yep very nice love it air conditioning is cold the heat is hot excuse me hiccuping and uh, very very nice so we'll have the backup camera and we will get a hitch we um, already ordered it but the the order isn't going to come in so we have to order it from another person they didn't have it in there's a little cubby hole down here they didn't vacuum it but that's okay and that's for your hitch when you put your hitch in for down here because you have your thing down here right here if you can see that's where your hitch is going to go and you take this out and you put it down in this cubby hole and when you get your hitch on and you have your ball on so it'll be really nice i will be able to maybe take my mother out a little bit more all three of us can go together it's got a wiper in the back i've never had one a wiper in the back before i don't i had an suv before but um it's been a long time and it was a gas guzzler. It was real bad, so I got rid of it. And that's when I bought Toyota. So, but I think this will be pretty good on gas. Um, not bad. So, it's got controllers here. So he bought the special thing because we're putting in the other radio, and so we'll have to have new controllers. So, uh, he's going to make it where I can use these controllers and stuff. So I won't have to. Um, you know, have to have reach over for the button, which is kind of whatever. It doesn't really matter to me. But, you know, you want it as factory made as possible. So, there we go. Very, very nice. I'm very happy with it. Very, very clean and very good looking. And I think I, think I will enjoy this a lot. So, and your mirrors go in too. Yeah, you put them in. See, you can take them out and put them in if you want. So, very nice. So, so far, so good. I'm very happy with it. Took it around. We took it on the highway coming home yesterday and uh, stuff like that. I am keeping my truck, but we're going to probably just use it around town. I mean, it's got over half a million miles on it. And it needs a little bit of work, so we'll do some work here and there on it. And um, we'll just use it around here. We will probably use it for the boat here. Um, you know, and I will use this car for going other places and going further away. So this is our plan to try to get out west. Yes, we want to try to go out west. As you know, Shea Bear, has, he's sick, and he has a hole in his heart with an aneurysm on top of it and they cannot do surgery for him so if the aneurysm busts he could die so we would like to see if we can go out west at least if we only get out there one time for a couple of weeks we're going to camp because camping is pretty cheap over there um, um, you know, I, I heard that you can go to some of these campsites for free, but you can only stay maybe one or two nights and we can move on somewhere else. And I hear they're pretty reasonable in the campsites and stuff that we want to go to. So we want to go to area, um, uh, what is it, area 56, isn't it? And we want to do Route 66 from top to bottom if we could. And we want to go to some of the ghost towns over there and just do something different go to mines or something like that uh, that my mine guy that we watch we would like to go there and maybe see him and talk to him because he's going to make his uh, a motel so maybe we could get over there you know something like that that's what we're trying to do so anyways there's the man he just woke up 
So he had a nap. He wasn't feeling good today. So we didn't do much. So tomorrow we will try to go fishing if we can. It's supposed to rain tomorrow again. It's nice now. Gorgeous out now. So we'll see. It poured earlier today. It was just coming down. So we'll see if we'll be able to do anything tomorrow or not. Anyways, Monkey says she's out for now, y'all. Bye. And wait for the next one. It's coming soon. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.